Good morning friends you are most welcome to Think Eyes channel today we are going to discuss practicing anthropology by Manning Nu and our topic is multimedia let us begin our topic practicing internet building an online multimedia web community the internet is vast and expanding computer network that has the potential to provide substantial resources for practitioners with unprecedented rapidity and economy it promises or perhaps threatens to transform the character of academic or professional work it provides a platform for the practitioners to get updated online information with a single keystroke in addition it has enhanced their knowledge as far as studying and research interest are concerned it helps them in collecting updated data for the area where they are practicing the discipline multimedia and tools like the internet gives practitioners instant access to millions of resources these materials can be called up instantly for cooperative learning critical thinking discussions problem solving and self study internet internet also helps practitioners in understanding and familiarizing him with other cultures the internet has propagated the network anthropological sources resources with which can be accessed by any practitioners who has a computer and an internet connection within anthropology archaeologists have been the most active innovators physical anthropologists and cultural anthropologists have made modest use of it some major forms of internet communication and presentation are email discussion list use net groups research consortia and collections scholarly journals and societies and online departments an email discussion list has created a unique form of academic activity through distributed discussion list individuals subscribe to a list devoted to a specific topic and auto automatically receive all messages posted to it they can accordingly submit queries answers comments notices etc usenet news groups are simply discussion list that are stored in an open central depository or bulletin board rather than distributed to subscribers research consortia and collections are attempts that developing anthropological databases and analysis through network discolorship the best developed and best publicized is the human genome project which has compiled an immense dna sequence database <coughs> besides cultural anthropologists have long maintained a major ethnographic collection in printed form through yale's human relations area files A scholars could compile an enormous cultural compendium compendium cross reference through a hypertext linked or linking system hypertext linking system eskim wimmer 1996 use of electronic anthropological scholarly journals like the jester sage and willy in many departments have established a substantial online presence they usually include on the listing of staff members academic programs course titles and calendar entries internet has emerged as a source of developing social contacts among people where friends and families keep in touch through email and social networking sites like facebook twitter whatsapp myspace etc various professionals of the practicing anthropologist we can surely say that practitioners are researchers however more often than not they do not simply study issues they go a step forward than that once people with anthropological training are placed in uh, any profession where their expertise is required they not only research problems but also create and bring about solutions they deal with distinct hurdles as professionals as professionals yet they confront them sensitive sensitively sensitively by presenting their anthropological outlook that is a perspective which reflects humanity and is based in the practice of cross cultural knowledge and acts all in all such professions are now blessed to have anthropologists who with their efficacy for solving problems or finding solution with their knowledge of multimedia are benefited immensely some professions taken up by anthropologists were where they use multimedia are business and advertisement or advertising in business and advertising the use of multimedia by anthropological practitioners can change the face of 
business, multimedia is used as a way to help to help present information to shareholders and co-workers, 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 geared with anthropological methods and knowledge in multimedia can let the anthropologist practice in these different avenues gracefully. Advertising business runs on observation of situations, the natural environment where these occurs and intimacy, where there is one on one connection with the customer. All these effectively are areas where an anthropologist can blend in productively. Such and such methodology clubbed with the use of multimedia for creating presentations and communications to sell ideas, etc., can create wonders. Forensic Science Practicing anthropologist with a background in anthropology and specifically in forensic anthropology and multimedia knowledge can be of immense use in forensic science and its laboratories. Today, digital photography plays an important role in the recording of crime scenes and thus helps in research and development R&D. Such professionals build the scientific grounds for the preparation of digital forensics, which involves research and publications. They may even be a bigger part of forensic laboratories where they may conduct check on digital equipment, perform network analysis, examine and evaluate digitized numbers, images, and test analog or digital audio video or to investigate legitimacy, augmentation, etc. Practicing anthropologists as digital forensic investigators may be found in both public and private sectors. They are employed in police departments, legal agencies, etc. Creative industries and fine arts. Creative industries are becoming increasingly important components of modern post-industrial knowledge-based economies. In the creative industries, anthropologists as practitioners can use multimedia for a variety of purposes ranging from fine art, entertainment, commercial art, reporting, media and software services, all depicting social structures in one form or the other. Many documentaries are made which are term ethnographic films highlighting cultural and social lives or episodes of people's or communities' innate experiences. These anthropologists may or may not be a part of the academy and may use their abilities to use the best of the anthropological and multimedia know-how to wave stories technologically for the world. The emergence of multimedia has also altered copyright laws association with technology and altered the creative industries. Mathematical and scientific research In mathematical and scientific research, practicing anthropologists with a background of in physical anthropology can use multimedia for modeling and simulation. For example, a practitioner can look at the molecular model of the particular substance and manipulate it to arrive at a new substance. One can know more about these in generals such as general of multimedia. Journal of multimedia. Multimedia in public places. Practicing anthropologists take help of multimedia to build standalone terminals or kiosks at hotels, railway stations, shopping malls, museums, and departmental stores for providing information and help. Such installation reduces demand on traditional inquiry booths and personnel, adds meaning, and works 24-7. By understanding the social milieu of, the, of an area, social milieu of an area, community, locality, etc. issue in supermarkets, hotels, and hospitals can be reduced. For example, digital screens which depict meaners in the supermarket kiosk or screens which show names of local restaurants, maps of the city, travel schedules, etc. in hotels or list of the names of doctors for different ailments and their visiting hours on display in hospitals. Museum kiosks at many archaeological museums are not only used to guide patrons through the exhibits but also provide great added depth, allowing visitors to browse through richly detailed information specific to, the, to that display. 
all these can be created by practitioners with clear anthropological skills at the last we will discuss the summary as you have learned about multimedia refers to the integration of multiple media such as voices video data text animation and graphics technology and culture can be combined to give the vision of the richness of culture one important tool needed for the same is interactive multimedia design which can aid the practitioners in studying human society and culture multimedia networks add an important dimensions to practicing anthropologist workouts it can link various societies into continuum and break down the distinction practitioners with an anthropological background can collaborate on worldwide projects applying multimedia reduces learning time and achievement levels are more than a standard deviation higher when learners can put their cognitive resources towards building such active connections they perform better in both retaining and applying information and the close pairing of text and illustration and of narration and animation result in both better retention and increased transfer to the solving of new problems may 2001 in education courses for example skills and knowledge are too often taught out of context to overcome this practitioners use multimedia to bring into their classrooms real world examples to provide a contextual framework important for learning the creation and expansion of multimedia services present many opportunities and challenges for practicing anthropologists this new medium is ideally suited to the discipline's character and methodology email can foster rapid and efficient communication within a dispersed and diverse academic community multimedia capabilities promise the creation of photographic video and sound sound archives that have never been adequately developed because of the high cost of publication and distribution hypertext publication opens the possibility for new forms of expression that are better suited to cultural data and anthropological methods than the writing of plain text it allows for ethnographic presentations expanded and embellished by the inclusion of field notes case studies corresponding text and visual images it allows the prospect of it allows the prospect for novel types of representation which can portray the varied level referring and interconnectedness of convoluted emblematic and social arrangements accordingly postmodernist might more easily realize their objectives of articulating numerous voices and perspectives without the restraints of linear exposition contemporary practitioners are now in the interesting position of the experiencing observing and perhaps controlling and solving a problem they have often attempted the obvious barrier to the development of applied multimedia in practicing anthropology is the reluctance or inability of practitioners to learn to use and develop this new technology although most practitioners now own computers and have come to find them indispensable for their writing actual use is limited to a few applications which take little advantage of the technology's full potential bernard and evans 1987 computer use has been restricted to word processing and statistical analysis statistical analysis also multimedia advantages may not be accessible to a large section of its intended users if they do not have access to multimedia capable machines plus one must have the knack or enough computer literacy to run related softwares in computers which helps in multimedia uses there are spheres of activity where in persons trained in the field of anthropology may apply the techniques of their science with respect to other developments in the science and technology thus while applying multimedia the practitioners should be aware of copyright issues and infringements especially when the incorporating video especially when incorporating video images and sound from other sources 
but we can definitely end the lesson by saying that multimedia and its technological application are engulfed in possibilities of changing the way things exist socially and culturally. We can in fact say that this has already started occurring at a large scale in many domains though the potential for newer high-tech conception do not end and it is in this that practicing anthropologists can be efficient contributors. Thank you very much.